Hey Wolf, how are you, sir? I'm fine, and you? You looking good? Good, good. Good to see you. Good to hear from you and see you again. <laughs> Me too. My nice to see you again. Yes, sir. Let's see who else we have here. We have Goldman. Yeah. Is it Goldman? Yeah. Okay. How are you, sir? I'm fine, sir. Good. Gustavo? Hi. How are you, sir? Uh, I'm fine, thank you. Good. Junaid? Hello, Matthew. How are you? How are you, sir? Good to hear from you again. Hello. Miguel? Hello. How are you, sir? Yeah, I'm doing great. What about you? Good, good. Uh, I had a pretty decent day today, so I can't complain oh. too much. Nice to hear that. Liz, how are you? Liz? I think she's on. Aladdin? Hello? Aladdin? Yeah, hello? How are you? I'm fine, how are you? Good. All right. Um, I'm glad you all tuned in on today. Um, to, uh, this class will focus on, uh, or rather, we'll discuss and uh, share thoughts and things of that nature in regards to career goals. Um, I know for some of you, you are uh, studying the English language to. Um, pursue uh, certain jobs and careers um, in the states and um, basically I just want to talk to you all uh, and get some of your uh, you know some of your thoughts and uh, some of your goals in regards to your career ambitions so um, having said that we'll go right into it um, Let's see, we'll start with uh, Goldman. Yes, uh, my ambition for, uh, my goal for learning English is to... I'm sorry, I'm sorry, Goldman, re re really quick. Um, okay, yeah, thank you. I'll be very fast. No, uh, go ahead. no, 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 no. I was going to say, introduce yourself first before you go okay. into it. Go ahead and give us your name, where you're from. Okay, yeah. Uh, some of the things that you like to do, and then you can go into your career goals. Yes, my name is uh, Godfrey. I'm from uh, Congo, DRC, Republic of Congo. Okay. Uh, I live in Denmark. Denmark, okay. Yeah, and uh, I'm studying. And, okay. Uh, I'm, so I'm not very good in English, so I want, just so I'm here so I can improve my English one day. It can help me. Okay, I'm sorry. Repeat that again, Goldman. Uh, I see. I was saying that uh, <laughs> I'm learning is uh, one of help me in the future. Okay, and uh, in regards to your career goals, what wh what do you do now uh, as far as work? Uh, I'm uh, I'm studying. You're studying. Yes. Okay, so now you're just you're just studying. Yes. So what what are you looking to go into? What, what once you take on your studies and um, you know. You, you pretty much succeed in your studies. What are you looking to go on to? Because what we study, we don't study English. We, we study Danish. 
Okay, so you're, stu you're studying English. Are you trying to become an English teacher, or are you just uh, studying the language so that you can pursue a career uh, yeah. in the United States? Not in the United States, just here where I'm, so I can con converse with the uh, people oh, okay. I, I meet. So your main goal is just to become fluent in the English language? Yeah, that is. Okay. Yeah. All right. Uh, Liz, how are you? I'm fine, thanks. And you? Good. Good to, good to see you and hear from you again. Uh, we're talking, yeah, me too. We're talking yeah. about um, yeah. career goals um, and ambitions. So if you just want to share with us uh, your career goals, uh, some of the things or some of the things that you would like to accomplish uh, professionally or uh, within your career? Um, well, uh, well this, this Friday I'm going to take uh, my TOEFL full exam so uh, because I need to take it to, in, to join to, to the uni, UDC Community College here in District of Columbia Okay. And I, I have I've already applied for um, psychology, okay. and so I would like to get my degree in psychology and put an office here and work by my work as a. I I would like to to have my my own business. Or something like that. Oh, okay. So you're looking to open your own business. What type of business are you looking for? <laughs> Um, especially um, related to my my career, that is psychology. Psychology. Yeah. Okay, so you're basically looking to uh, pretty much start your own your own business or your own practice in psychology. Um. Yeah. Okay. I think that's wonderful. Um, you definitely pursue that. Um. So what are, what are your what are your short term goals? And, and pursuing that, going towards that. Oh, uh, I don't understand that question. Okay, short short term goals. When I say short term goals, oh, short. Yes, short term um, goals. Like, what what would you like to accomplish uh, between the present time and the very near mm -hmm. future? Actually, I don't know. Maybe um, uh, work and earn. Um, some money in order to put a uh, business in my country. For okay. example, yeah. For example, for example, here uh, um, we we can we can wash um, cars that in order to transport our uh, children, really. But in my country, we we can take uh, like car or bus. Uh -huh. but yes. But we have to pay, and that is not not free. Uh, but also, um, for example, I have a nephew there, and she has like a mobility, so he has to pay like every month, like one one hundred soles. Okay. But it's soles here is like fifteen fifty dollars, I think. And so I would like to put like buses in in order to get more money. <laughs> yeah. Right. Exactly. Exactly. Okay. Mm -hmm. That's good. That's good. Um. Let's see. Who else do we have? I think we just have one join us. Uh, Aladdin. Yeah. Uh. Why don't you go ahead and tell us about uh some of your career goals and maybe short term and long term goals uh in regards to pursuing uh that particular career. About about my goals. Yes. Uh, like, what are you looking to accomplish uh, in your career? Uh, okay. Uh, I'm fresh to graduate. Uh, now I'm working a webmaster, so uh, I'm look. Uh, I will. Uh, I think uh, I'll be a developer, web developer, in okay. future. Okay. So I'm I'm working uh, on myself uh, and working hard. Well, you gotta work hard. You know, hard work pays off. Yes. <laughs> yes, sir.
So uh, basically, when you say a developer, uh, what type of developer are you? And uh, what aspect of developing and becoming a developer? Uh, web, web developer. Wood? Web. You said a wood developer? No. No, web, web developer. Word. Web, web, website. Web, 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 website. Web. Gotcha, gotcha. Hey, let me ask you guys, uh, is, the chat, is the chat working for you guys? Yes, it yes. is. Yes. It's not working for me. <laughs> for some reason, I'm not certain why. <laughs> okay, ask all the people web developer to help you. Exactly. <laughs> Aladdin, we need your expertise right now, actually, as you speak. <laughs> as we speak. Yeah, it's not working for me. Okay, so I'll have to kind of do without for right now. Uh, okay. Gustavo. Hi. How are hey. you, sir? We're, hey. we're discussing career goals. What are... What are what are your ultimate career goals, and um, what are your short-term goals in, or, in, in regards to reaching that goal, and what is your ultimate long-term goal in your career? Uh, well, I, I'm a veterinarian, and, and now I'm studying a, a specialis specialization. Specialization? Yes. Okay. Uh, it's about a uh, uh, illness uh, uh, or disease of the animals. Disease? Yes. Disease of the what now? Uh, uh, disease of the of the animals. Animals. And, yes. Okay. And disease in, that is in relation with with the with the, with public health. Okay. And, and and I almost finished my specialization. Uh, I have to write an, an article. Okay. And, um, uh, and the article is about uh, um, uh, um, it's about an insect. Insects. Okay. That uh, affects animals. Uh, wild animals uh, and humans. Okay. Um, and now uh, I'm, I almost finished uh, um, uh, uh, English. Uh, my my uh, studying English online. Okay. Um, oh, so you're you're taking uh, English courses online? Yes. Yes, okay. I do. Okay. Good deal. How, how um, far how far into that are you with the English course? Are uh, you on or? I'm uh, in the last in the last level or last semester? Yes, in the okay. last semester. Semester is the term you want to use. That's yes. plus, and in regards to the English language, yes. Okay, good deal. So you're you're almost done. Yes. Good deal. Um, yes. So um, ultimately, is that the career that you want to uh, pursue and take on? Um, I don't understand. Uh, can you repeat? As ultimately, what you're studying is that the career that you would like to. Take on as a is that is that the uh, the field that you would like to take on as a profession? Uh, uh, the field uh, I like uh, is uh, relation with the public health. Public health, uh, okay. Relation with uh, disease uh, transmitted transmitted by by the food or and that kind of 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 diseases or yeah. Well, once once you once you conquer that uh, educational background, uh, you'll basically have some range as in regards to uh, the field that you can go into. You know, there's different things that you can take on in relation to the to to that field uh, that you can kind of go into. So, 
uh, you know, I, I think that'll be great. Once you once you complete that, you know, um, you'll have that educational background, and and you, I think you'll be able to pursue uh, a few different uh, careers within that field. Mm, yes. Yeah, that's great. That's great, man. Uh, we have. Uh, is it Hader? Hello, no. Um, yeah, I'm with you. How are you, sir? Uh, we're discussing uh, career goals. Um, what what career would you like to pursue, and what uh, what, what, do what you are your short what what are your short term goals and long term goals in, reg in, reg in regards to reaching that career goal? What do you mean by career go? I don't understand. This is my first time to join you. I don't okay. have an idea. Well, basically, career goal, we're discussing what you ultimately would like to be professionally. Ah, would what would you be, like to hmm. pursue professionally? Um, hmm. What would you like to make a career out of? What field, what field, of, what field, what of, field work? of work? My field? Uh, do you mean my field? My field? Uh, I'm a medical I'm a student. student. A medical student in the sixth grade uh, in, from a Nahrain University in Iraq. Um, 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 I like to be. I mean, I would like to be um, uh, a surgeon in the future. Surgeon. A surgeon. Yeah. Cool. Thank you. Um, um, I, I'm. Uh, my brother. My brother. My name. Um, this account uh, of my brother Haider. Uh, and I joined to you by his account. Uh, um, uh, he he told me about you and about uh, your uh, yeah, uh, yeah, uh, your website for uh, for conversation and improve our uh, English language by conversation with you. Um, cool. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. I'm glad. I'm glad he recommended. Have you good I'm glad he recommended me. <laughs> nice to meet you, of course. Nice to meet you as well. So you're saying you're you're, you're looking into being a surgeon. Are you currently taking courses going toward that? Mm -hmm. um, um, this year is the is the sixth year and is the uh, sixth grade of uh, my oh wow studying the medicine. Uh, I mean the last year in the in the in the in the college of medicine. Okay, so you're in your sixth year of college. A uh, sixth year of college. Okay. Uh, I will be graduated this year, at the end of this year, and be okay. a rotator. I will be a doctor. So, are you excited about that? Hey, really. <laughs> <laughs> so, ultimately, in becoming a surgeon, are you looking to, uh, you know, start your career where you are currently? Where, where where are you? Uh, where where are you stationed now? Where where do you reside? Where do you live? Where I where, where I live? Yes. Uh, I'm living in Iraq, Baghdad, from Baghdad. Baghdad. Okay. Are right. you look Are you looking once you uh, complete your courses and ultimately are you looking to start as a surgeon in Baghdad or are you looking to come into the United States? Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Uh, I. Mm, there is a, there is multi um, uh, uh, idea and multi. I'm thinking to uh, go abroad of Iraq and uh, and take my or finish my uh, my study there. Okay. To take uh, to take, uh, to take uh, uh, the um, my uh, I mean my specialties or sub specialties in the in the surgery. Okay. Um, uh, my my uncles. My uncle uh, lives in London, in England. Okay. Uh, I may have chance to travel there. Uh, if uh, if I find uh, a chance to travel in United States, I will do. I will do. And uh, and um, uh, I have. Uh, but first, uh, or 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 uh, initially, I have to do an exam there, which is called USMLE. USMLE exam. Okay. Uh, uh, to 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 um, um, yeah I mean I mean to, to I have to make a USMLE exam to um, bring my my uh, my 
or to improve improve me as a as a doctor. Okay. You understanding me? Mm -hmm. Yeah, I get it. I get it. Okay. So we wish you luck on that, man. <laughs> I said we we wish you luck on that. <laughs> thank you. Thank you. Hopefully, I won't need any surgery done. <laughs> <laughs> thank you very much, sir. Uh, we have. Thank you very much to you, sir. No problem. Um, Junaid? Yes, Matthew. Uh, career goals. What are your career goals? What are you looking to uh, pursue professionally? And uh, basically, what are your short term goals in regards to accomplishing that okay, in your career? Uh, I am trying to be an, uh, a website design with David of Mar, and uh, now I am taking uh, some classes uh, in Arizona for uh, web design. Okay. Yeah. How 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 far along are you uh, in those courses? Oh, uh, almost. I finished the courses. Almost done. Yeah, almost done. Okay. Good. And uh, what what type of web design do you do you specialize in? There is no specialized for web design. Uh, the web design there has uh, a lot of programs to design websites, so you can learn all the programs and use it as you need. So you you're not you're not focusing on any specific type. Yeah. Of uh, web design, you just—it's just different. It's broad, right? Yeah, it's general. Very, very broad. Okay. Yeah. Good. So, um, are you looking to start your own business in that, or are you looking to be hired on with a with a big um, with, with with a big company in regards to web designing, or uh, how are first you looking time, to go? Yeah, first time I try to work in any company, not a big company. Just okay. to got to, to, to got uh, some experience because the right. experience, yeah, it's, it's important. Right, to, you definitely you definitely want to gain some experience. Yeah, to improve your skills and then you can change your employment to the big company. Exactly, exactly, very yeah, true. So this is what I working uh, for. Well, I think you'll do well, man. And I, 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 I may need some uh, work done from you, so. Keep okay. me in mind no when you start no the web design. Just, just <laughs> I want uh, to ask you if the chatting working with you now or not. Say again. The chatting is working with yeah, you now or not? You. Um, it may be. I don't. No, is, I don't think it's working for me. There is to the left up. There is chat. You can. Yeah, listen. I see. This is just for the class. You cannot chat with uh, all the people. Right. Just for, yeah, just for our class. Okay, okay. So can, you can use it uh, to send anything for us. Okay, so, oh, it's just this, it's just the class now. Okay, good deal. Yeah, just, yeah, okay. All right. Uh, Kareem. Hello. How are you, sir? We are discussing uh, career goals. Um, first of all, why don't you go ahead and tell us a little bit about yourself. Okay, um, uh, I'm a student in the Faculty of Commerce, uh, Accounting Development, in uh, fourth year. Um, accounting? Seven years old, yes. Uh, but um, I felt uh, in the college for a uh, long years, for a long time, and uh, I hate this department. So uh, my short, uh, short goals uh, uh, to finish my studies uh, and to look um, forward uh, to courses in uh, accounting or uh, auditing or anything like that. Okay. I manage my uh, profession uh, to computer uh, work because uh, I like uh, using computer uh, like every. Uh, Kareem, are you on a, are you on a headset or are you on a? Do you have headphones on headsets? Yeah, I have. Um, you have a uh, cause on my phone. Oh, okay, because. Okay. It's making a, a, a some type of effect on your voice, making it hard to understand a little bit. 
You still with us? Kareem? We may have lost him. Liz, did we speak with you yet? Liz? Can you guys hear me? Yes, but yes. yes. Okay. All right. I guess right. she's busy. <laughs> Kareem, are you still with us? Yes, uh, I'm here. Okay. So, um, in regards to the accountant, when, when you're pursuing that accountant career, I'm a, and I'm assuming you are looking to become an accountant professionally, are you looking to start your own accountant firm or are you looking to uh, maybe <laughs> work for my own business uh, but uh, I'm willing to uh, or wishing to have my own business okay so maybe start off working with a big a large accountant firm and then eventually <laughs> opening your own accountant firm right yes, uh, at least to get uh, some expertise experience in the field okay all right so we wish you all the luck with that, and we think you can pull it off, man. <laughs> Thank you. Great. Liz. Yeah, I'm here. Have we heard from you and your career goals yet? Yes. <laughs> okay. Let's see here. Um, is it Newman? Nauman? No? Wolf? Yes, I hear that. All right. So, what can, we, what can we expect from you professionally, sir? Well, my biggest goal, I want to settle down in Playboy Mansion. You want to settle down in? Playboy Mansion. Playboy Nation? Mansion, Mansion. <laughs> Did you say Playboy Nation? Yes, Playboy Mansion, Mansion. Oh, Playboy Mansion. <laughs> yes, sir, exactly. Wolf, my biggest... Wolf, why am I not surprised? No, okay, okay, look at this. Okay, my actually, I want to set, uh, set up a business, yeah? I want to make, I want to set up a corporation. Corporation, uh, Yeah, okay. under, underwear corporation, just for okay. ladies, just uh, like a Victoria's Secret, you know? I want to start in the beginning of the, my career, and I want to open the one small shop, then become really famous is getting bigger 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 can you imagine man all the all so, the all the universe in the all ladies uh, when buy my uh, company's products like uh, underwear they carry my name on their ass because it's both corporation okay so you said your, your corporation is what now you don't understand what I mean. You know what I mean. No, you don't understand me. You um, lost. Yeah. What, 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 type, what type of corporation you said? Okay. I want to set up business about corporation as a woman underwear. Oh, woman you, underwear. Listen, listen. And can, can you imagine is a, this corporation is becoming very famous and bigger. Uh, I, I reach uh, really high uh, sales level then in the all around the world when ladies buy my products then they carry out my name on their ass because label is wolf the label is wolf yeah <laughs> so Do you get it no I don't get it no <laughs> <laughs> I'm I'm trying to okay. get okay. Listen, what did you understand so far? I, I from what I understand, it seems like you're maybe looking into starting uh, a line of women's lingerie. Yes, that's right. Okay, then go on. And that's pretty much what I got. And you were saying okay. something about the logo and wolf. Yes, yes. Listen, the label is my label. You know. Yes. Is it is uh, is my name Wolf? Okay, the label is okay. Wolf. So you're gonna okay. name it. You're gonna name the product Wolf. 
Yeah, in the okay. lun- in, in, in the in the underwear, yeah, is lingerie. Uh, normal generally labels. Uh, in you know everybody knows where is the labels. I right. made when mm-hmm. made this uh, by my products. They carry my name on the ladies on the ass my label wolf. <laughs> <laughs> Wolf, I'm not surprised, man. <laughs> I'm just, but it's a, it's a, it's a real goal. No, no, I, no. I realize that you're very serious. <laughs> <laughs> because yeah, it's yeah, just I'm joking. I'm yeah, just, just so so. Let me ask you this on on a serious note. Um, what what ha, what are you doing to pursue that now? I mean, I you know, I think that's uh a a a I think that's a legitimate goal to uh, start your own establishment. Um, ladies lingerie, I mean, you know, there's definitely a market for that. There's a great market for that. So what are you doing? Um, what are you currently doing? What are your short-term goals and your long-term, long-term goals in regards to pursuing that and, and, and actually making that venture, uh, happen? Yeah, in fact, my short-term goals, okay, I continue my life, but I don't believe in uh, reaching the goals because if you reach if you want to reach your goals you have to meet right person in the right time if you don't meet the right person in the right time it doesn't it doesn't matter it uh, doesn't make a difference if you well well, well Wolf, I, I I agree and disagree with you you know um, sometimes if, if, sometimes things do happen by chance but you know, even if you're not meeting the right people at the same time, you still have to uh, be in preparation. So when you actually do meet the right person and you get the opportunity, you are fully prepared to take that opportunity on. You understand what I'm saying? Okay. Yeah. Imagine yourself. You are the uh, very clever man in the world, but if you don't have, if you don't get the opportunity, how how you will prove the uh, your skills. Oppor- opportunity, opportunity will come. Um, how, how, how come? But, but, look, hear me out. Hear me out. Yeah. Oppor- opportunity will come. It's just a matter of when the opportunity comes. But the question is, when the opportunity comes, are you prepared to take on the opportunity that's presented to you? So I'm saying, I'm saying all that to say. That it goes back to the question that I asked you because um, you want to start this lingerie line for women, and like I said, it's a very legitimate um, venture that you're looking to go into. But it takes a lot of work, uh, research, and footwork, and 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 starting a business and making a business happen. I say that with my own experience. Uh, as a business owner, um, it takes a lot. It, it, it you know, it, it, it can take two thousand hours, two two thousand hours, you know, work starting a business, just doing all the research and putting all the footwork in to start a business. So that's um, that's why I'm asking you, what what type of preparation are you? Um, what are you doing to prepare for what you're trying to do? But I'm prepared. I, 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 I have said already. I need to meet the right person in the in the right time. Of course, oh. I, I, of course, I, I, I had a profession. I, 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 did, I, I, I have a lot of things in, in my mind. Of course, I can present them, express myself, express my right. business line. But okay. if, if I don't have the opportunity, it's just. I, I get it. I understand. Let's, but let's listen to what I'm about to say. Let's let's just. Pretend that I am the right person at the right time right now talking to you and you have the opportunity to convince me to invest in your idea. What how would you convince me right here, right now? That's 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 the point that I'm making. How would you are are you prepared to be able to convince me? Let's just say I'm a person, I'm a I'm a multi billionaire and I'm looking to invest in ideas. How okay. would you convince me right now? Okay, because I actually I don't have to do too much because my uh, my stuff I show you my stuff they present I think they they uh, my stuff is speaking with you is is they really is a quality products 
they, if you clever to, yeah, I mean, if you if you want to make a money, you can catch the, this opportunity. It's also opportunity for you. You can make a good money in about my products. I hear you. Because I I don't have to uh, speak too much about my products, but I don't uh, have. Uh, you, you can see in your eyes because my 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 product is really unique. I'm gonna share something with you, and I I don't doubt I don't doubt that your product is unique, and um, I'm gonna share something with you because I'm a business uh, major and marketing major. The greatest products in the world of today still have to be advertised. They still have to be sold to the people. The people still have to be convinced to purchase. So you can't base a product strictly off of the actual product and its uniqueness and things of that nature. Yeah, that does help it, but you have to be able to sell it. Everything, ha everything has to be sold. Uh, even the most, you know, popular brands, they still have to be sold. They still have to be advertised. McDonald's still advertised. No, you know? no, hold on, hold on. McDonald's, they, uh, McDonald's and Burger King is it's it's their their commercial their commercial is different. It doesn't work like that. Uh, it's a, it's a good commercial about my products, but we have a successful as uh, a big businessman. Also, uh, you, you have an environment you, you, in, around your environment. I think there are a lot of uh, famous people and fashion model. If you give them my products, uh, they they we can use them. That's advertisement. We that's true. Yeah. That's and, 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 that's, and you know what? You you that's it's clever. This is this is not real commercial. Yeah, and and I'm not saying you couldn't get an opportunity right here, right now. You know, sometimes that's just how things happen. You know. You, you you just run into the right opportunity at the right time, and it could take off right there and at that very moment. So that's correct. Do you know the Starbucks have become successful? Because in beginning of the Starbucks, some celebrities carry out the Starbucks coffee, and they a paparazzi shoot them. Then become successful. Not about is commercial or something like that. that right. I mean television. I, I'm talking about television commercial, not 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 about television commercials. Right. Because yeah. thing, things are all about popularity, you know. Um, it doesn't necessarily have to be the best product in the world, as long as it's popular, right? Okay, we can use your environment, your uh, your celebrity friends, and then, uh, hundred percent, I give you guarantee. Uh, my products is in the sell out. And they'll sell out. Yeah. And you're confident about that. Yeah, and and also is a I I. I it's a, I, I will I will give you thirty percent. Well, 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 well okay. Thirty percent sounds good. We'll come yeah. back to that. <laughs> yeah. Let me let me ask some of the other uh, participants in the class. What, what what do you guys think about what Wolf is saying now? Do you guys agree with with his approach, or would you give him some different advice? Mm -hmm. Not not for the dog. I don't. Not for the dog. Will bite us. Hey, Dar. I'm afraid of the dog. Hey, Dar. Hey, Dar. Can you guys Hello. hear me? Yeah, yeah, we can. Yes, hear. yes. I, okay. Yes. Hola. Uh, hey, Dar. I, I will. Um, sorry, I'm with you. Okay. Yeah. My the question that I was asking is, what do you agree with Wolf is saying in regards to what he's trying to accomplish in opening, starting his own uh, company? Would you give him some different type of advice based off of what you what you've heard from him? Uh, sorry, uh, I beg your pardon. The sound is interrupted. Not. To, uh, Come to me fully. Um, I'm, I'm broken, broken okay. Sentence. I was just asking, would you give, would you give Wolf some advice based off of uh, what you heard he's trying to accomplish and starting his own business? Hmm. No. I don't have. Uh, I don't have an idea about. Uh, um, uh, 
the branch okay. you work in, uh, in, in. I don't have the idea. Yani, in which branch you work. Uh, okay. So I, I, well, I, I, I don't have him. We'll, we'll come back to that topic. I think, I think Wolf is sold on his own idea. <laughs> yeah. I think uh, he need uh, to sell this idea in the United States because some countries they don't record your uh, your logo or your what you, you what you design. You Which, can and yeah, that's, that's you, very true. That's kind of yeah. like the point that I was trying to make to him. Yeah, uh, because uh, in many countries when you make something and uh, all the people uh, buy this thing. Many company they 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 directly use the same design, right? That, but in sorry. United that, yeah, in United the States they, you can uh, make a license for you. Nobody right. can make the same design. Of course, right. that's that's why so I am that, I, I am speaking to Matthew. Matthew, uh, take a license for me because he's a big business man. <laughs> yeah. So you ask Matthew to. <laughs> To take license for you, and how much? How much you give my few uh, percentage? Because exactly. You, no, yeah. Yeah, I, 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 I have said. I have said already. I, I give you thirty percent. Thirty percent of my income. Hey, thirty percent. That's hey, good. Hey, Junaid, you're hired. <laughs> you're hired. I need you to. I need you to represent me. <laughs> uh, no, this is this is the truth. How how work? Um, how they work in the company like yeah. this? If yeah. you want to register your design in the United States, you must pay. You must pay. That's right. Yeah. Nothing's, and, nothing's and, he free, give right? You, and he give you my few thirty percent. That's good. <laughs> that that is good. Yeah. I, I share I share my income, and yeah. also. Okay, yeah, that's also, good. Yeah, but, but okay. If uh, if is my name not only the labels, nobody buy it. Because yeah. I I sell my labels. Is it labels is also is important. Yes, it's important. If if this labels, uh, you design this labels, it's important to register these labels, to register your design. And some countries they don't have this law. Okay, right. uh, okay. I I I I want I, I want to add this in my contract. <laughs> oh, so you make you uh, want to make contract with Matthew? Let's the, uh, let's let's, let's come let's come back let's come back to that because. I think Wolf can go on and on and on about this. <laughs> we have uh, Rebecca. Welcome, How Rebecca. How are you? Fine, and you? How are you? <laughs> Good. We're discussing career goals. Uh, tell us a little bit about yourself first, first and foremost, and then uh, kind of fill us in on what you're looking to accomplish uh, as far as your career. Inspires my career. <laughs> yes. It's funny. Uh, well, I'm Rebecca and starting out working. Yes. First, first, um, start start with telling us a little bit about yourself, your name, where you're <laughs> from, and some of the things you like to do. Ah, <laughs> okay. <laughs> uh, so I'm from Spain, and you're in Madrid, the capital. I'm from Real Madrid. Yes, I like sports and football. Okay. Um, I don't know. I like all kind of outdoor sports. Outdoor sports. Okay. Yes. Good deal. So uh, now that we know a little bit about you, career. What are you looking to accomplish in your career? What are you looking for? Yes. What are you? What are your career goals? What are you looking to accomplish professionally? In your career? Uh, well, now I'm studying chemistry. I haven't finished yet, but I want, I would like to finish my degree in uh, in Canada the next year. Okay. So that's why I'm trying to improve my English here. Okay. And you said you're studying chemistry. Are you looking into becoming a scientist or? If I'm looking what? I said, are you, you said you're studying chemistry, or you, I'm sorry, a scientist. Are you looking to become a chemist? I can I can see, sorry. Okay. You said you're studying chemistry, right? Yes, I'm studying chemistry. Okay, what are you looking to do uh, with, with, with that background, with that education? Ah, I want to start a 
I would like uh, to make some projects in inorganic, in solid state chemistry, but I'm not sure if I get it. So you're looking to come to the United States and? Uh, no, Canada. And you're, you're looking to establish a career in the United States? I, I can hear you. What, once you complete your studies and you start your career, are you looking to stay there? Are you looking to stay in Spain or are you looking to come to the United States? Um, I am looking to go to Canada, not the United States. Canada, okay, yes. gotcha, okay. gotcha. <laughs> Okay, good deal. Take, take your clothes with you because it's very cold. Yes, very cold. Yes, oh, yes I know, I know. I started here in Madrid, it's cold. <laughs> very cold. The, the, the weather is under 30, the temperature. But okay. All right. That's important. <laughs> Okay, so let's talk a little about um, what about um, like your professional profiles? Do you guys have professional profiles? What do you mean? What do you mean? Like your resume and things like that? Yeah, of course. You guys do? Yeah, of course. Okay, what are they. Us, uh, to write and no resumes. Resumes? Are they updated? No. What do you mean as a main set? So you, you always want to keep an updated resume. Um, because mainly because of uh, what Wolf said. You never know when an opportunity will present itself. So you know, you always want to keep uh, your professional resume updated and, and mm -hmm. you know, kinda of handy in a sense. So of course, yes. Definitely. You guys have been um, basically uh, showed or taught how to handle your resumes, correct? Yeah. Okay. But the difficult thing, they ask you to put all your information in one paper. Yes. And that, 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 becomes, that becomes challenging because uh, you, you, want, you want to express and you want to let it be known the, back, you know, the, the extent of the background that you have but they want you to put it on one sheet. So you, you basically kind of have to like abbreviate uh, your yeah. background in a sense. And sometimes you, you must remove some information. Yes. And there's, craft, there, there's, there's crafty ways to do that. But I guess the, the, best, the best way to go is to put the information that kind of sticks out the most on yeah. your resume. And then that th those... Um, those highlights will help you to, uh, you know, get a job interview, and then you can focus and elaborate more yeah. on your entire background. You understand what I'm saying? Yes, yes, I understand. In the interview, yeah. you can give them all the information. Right, you give them all the information. All the information. You, you can elaborate more yeah. on your background, and you know, get a chance to sell yourself. Because basically, yeah. that's what a resume and an interview is. It's, it's basically selling yourself. Yeah. And Matthew. also, you need you need uh, now in, uh, the cover letter with the resume. Yes, cover letter. That is correct. Cover letter. That's correct. Cover letter, and in and, and some cases, you want to include your references as well. Yeah, as well, the references. Yeah. Matthew. Yes. yes, sir. Yeah. Do, uh, do you think is it, is it important uh, CV or your uh, appearance? Is your appearance affect your CV or is it your, important? Your appearance? Is it, is it important on your CV or affect your CV? What do you think about this? Is, what What's do you think about a, a, a physical uh, appearance? Phys physical appearance is, is, is very important. Um, do it's, you believe it's, it affect your CV? Do you, it believe, you said yeah. does it affect what? Your, yeah, your CV. Interview your CV. How, the, how, how they know your uh, appearance in the CV? Ah, by your, putting a photo. In a picture, in a full picture, from yeah. picture. You don't, you don't put, uh, don't put picture in the, your resume. After okay, this, no, 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 no. Is that, is that what he's saying? 
Yeah, no, you don't, you don't want to put a picture on your resume. No, don't you don't want to. You don't want to put a picture. Okay, yeah. if you want to go to interview, but uh, interview it can see you when you. Uh, well, that's the whole thing. Um, you know, basically that would be the next step. They want to see mm -hmm. if they like you on paper first. Yeah. So you know, once they, you know, see your resume and they like the way your resume looks. And that makes them more interested in actually meeting you face to face. You know, the r resume is half the battle. Uh, and then once they see you, you know, maybe that helps them. That gives you another edge because if your p appearance is proper, then it says, okay, that's even that's even all the more better because not only does he look good on paper, he looks he looks great and he looks professional in person. So now. Let's actually speak to him and interact and, and have an interview to see if he speaks well, and you know yeah. we can base our decision off of that. Uh, so, sorry, Matthew. Uh, let me put on that way. Uh, do you think interview pay attention your CV or your appearance? Which one important for interview? What's your, your skills? Opinion? I think it's yeah. the answer yeah. you yeah. they need your skills. Yeah, your they skills. Discuss. Your skills are, are, are very important. Important. Your, your skills, the way you carry yourself, the way you speak, the way you present yourself. Um, you know. It's like marketing. As, yeah, exactly. It's just like it's like selling yourself. Yeah. Like I said, uh, some of the most, some of the biggest major companies in the world, it's not the best product in the world. It's just the most popular, and they really sell themselves. Yep. You know. Um, McDonald's doesn't have the best cheeseburger in the world. Yeah. They really don't. But yeah, but all the world they know McDonald's. <laughs> exactly, the world eats McDonald's, but it's it's not the best hamburger you've ever had. Yeah. It's just not. Mm -hmm. You know, but it's it's how they sell it. It's how they market it. It's how they make it more popular. How they how they make you and I, the consumer, buy their product. Yeah. So. It's the same way in an interview. It's selling yourself. It's okay. uh, making Imagine, yourself making yes. yourself stand out from the rest. Okay, so you you're talking about uh, selling yourself. Uh, can uh, imagine uh, your uh, skills and your background, your education is very uh, in, in a perfect way, but your uh -huh. you, uh, your, uh, your little bit uh, looks weird and a social. It's a dilemma. Yeah. Here's here's the thing. No 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 one candidate is a hundred percent perfect. Yeah. So you know, employers when making their decisions, they take the good with the bad, or not even so much bad, but maybe the good with the you know not as skilled in this area type of approach. You know, but they look at it as something to be able to work with. In other words. We feel like this person is good enough to, to the point that we can develop them to be what we need them to be. You understand what I'm saying? You guys understand what I'm trying to say? Yes. Yeah. 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 It's yes. like it's like you know they say okay, you know it, he needs some work in this area, but he appears to be really great in this area, which is something that we really need. <laughs> and he's just he's kind he's just okay in this area, but we feel like we can help him to develop in that area. And ultimately get him to where we need him to be, to you know carry out the position effectively. You guys understand what I'm saying? Yes. Uh, of course. Yeah. Yeah. So, so Wolf, just to kind of answer some of your questions, all of it's important. All of it is important. You, you know, you kind of yeah. got to bring a little bit of all of it to the table. You, your appearance has to be right. Yeah, you have to speak well. You have to present yourself well. You have to have a certain amount of skill sets. You know, it's 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 like a good portion of all of it has to be good. Not perfect, you know, but it has to be good. Do you know if it's necessary write your hobbies in the CV? In the CV, I mean, in Spain, you don't have to write your hobbies on your or your interest. That's not a job. You said you don't have to write your resume. Yes. Okay. So, yes. how 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 is it handled there? If, if if there's no resumes, is it just strictly like uh, job applications, and then based off the application, they call you in for an interview? How does that work? 
how, how do they how do they handle the hiring process in Spain? Hiring process? Yeah, I was uh, asking Jeff. Rebecca because oh, yeah, I think Jeff. I think we lost her. Yeah, we lost her. Okay. I think some countries they don't have any resume or cover letters. Yeah, they, I, I can yeah. imagine. I, I believe that's true. Yeah, they just go to the company and they say, "Okay, I I need uh, to work with you." Right. And they make a quickly interview, and then they got to the job. Right, and it's like you know they kind of see where where they are and see if they uh, kind of match up to what they're looking for, and then based off of that. They, mm -hmm. Yeah. So okay, so last 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 thoughts, guys. Last last thoughts. We have about four minutes left. So uh, go ahead and, and, and let's get some of the last thoughts in. Do you guys have any questions about uh, what we're discussing? Yeah, one more thing. Some countries, uh, you can, in some countries, you can find uh, more opportunity than other countries. Also, yeah, it's not true. In, in some countries, as, uh, people reach their goals is more easily. But yeah, some other countries, like a develop, developing countries, is much difficult to climb into the career letter. That's very true. That's true. It's not equal. That's true. Uh, actually, in some countries, the connection is very important to get a uh, interview opportunity or at the end the job, especially for the university. For example, in in America, <laughs> the acceptance in any university, besides the skills, need a connection sometimes. That's what I believe. I'll say this, and I'll, we'll we'll end we'll end on this note. I've, in my experience, I've seen um, that people from other countries that come to the U.S. Yeah. they often get great opportunities here. Yes. You yeah, know, it, it depends on the position. Often, often foreigners and people from other countries, uh, like you guys, like if you were to come here, often you, 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 often foreigners run into really decent opportunities here. Yes, and I, I've seen that happen quite a bit, mm -hmm. quite a bit here. But so, uh, one, one thing is important: uh, of any person come to United States. Uh, his certification are not accepted here because the United States just accept the certification from from here, from inside yeah, the United that's States. That's correct. Uh, so it, you it, need. Uh, it depends. Uh, depends on the specialty. If sometimes you, you have to. Of... Yeah. Sometimes you have to further your education or get certified in in, in certain areas. That's true. Yes. Yeah. That's true. And they said equivalent uh, your certification, but they don't accept you directly. Right. That's yeah, well. That can be the case. That's true. The difficult, the difficult thing when you apply the job in the United States, thousand or maybe million person they apply in the same job. So. Well, yeah. Maybe yeah. not. Maybe not a million, but. I know. I know. Quite a few people applying I for know, the same type of job. That's true. I I made interview in one company. And in that day, just that day, 1,500 persons come to the interview. That's a lot. Just one day. <laughs> just one day. This that's is a lot. lot. Yeah, yeah, that's a lot. So, <laughs> yeah. That is a lot. Okay, guys. Well, um, as always, it, it was a pleasure. This hour was a pleasure. Uh, it kind of went by really fast, and I think we had some great conversation. Uh, we're going to see if we can try to help Wolf get his uh, – Lingerie line off the line off the ground. Wish me luck. I'm gonna wish you luck, and I want my thirty yeah, percent. Of course. <laughs> but um, I think we had some good conversation. It was good to hear some of the goals and uh, uh, ambitions that you all have career-wise, uh, and the things that you would like to accomplish. I would just like to tell you all to stay encouraged and keep moving forward toward your goals yes. uh, and what you're trying to accomplish and you all will do well. Um, I hope to see you guys um, okay. in some of the later classes that I have scheduled. And as always, it was a pleasure, guys. So we'll end, we'll end it there. You guys have a great day, okay? You too. Thank you. Take care. Thank you. you too. Talk to you guys Thank next you. time. Bye-bye. Right. Take, Take care. care. Bye. Bye.